be aggressive, be be aggressive, be aggressive, be be aggressive. Hi guys, I'm Zoe, and today I want to talk about the Running Dead. 2022 that I did with uh, my dad, my mom, and my brother. So we did this as a family. Well, not really, because me and my dad were the runners, and we ran 1.6 kilometers, and my mom and Dylan were in the bus, and they were zombies, and they, well, they didn't want to put paint on their face, so they just wore some tattoos and they were hiding in the bus and they had to try and grab our flags because we had um, a belt around the runners and they had like this thing on their head. I'll show a picture right here. And for the runners, we had to attach three flags on us and they had velcro on them and the zombies had to take them when we were doing the obstacle courses or when we were running through the bus. But the obstacle courses that I hated, well, I didn't hate. Well, I found a bit harder was the um, the balloon kind of like a haunted house where when you got out, you could hear a chainsaw and you could like kind of smell the gas. So I thought it was real. So when I got up to it, I was like, oh my gosh, no, 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 don't hurt me. And I tried to avoid it. But anyway, uh, no, the next one was the tires and in my head I was like Zoe you need to step on every tire because if you don't then I felt like I couldn't say that I finished all the obstacle courses. I also want to mention that there was a zone where I ran it was called the um the rage zone and there were some hockey players and they had to try and get us and that was one place where the zombies could run and at the time when I was running I didn't really listen to the lady that was saying you can go around if you want if you don't want to go through the rage zone and I wasn't really listening to her and I didn't know that until I looked at the footage and anyways I went for there and I only had one flag when I got out of it and dad lost all his flags. That's why I said that he only survived one round because that's where he lost all his flags. So that was pretty scary. And we won these beautiful medals. My dad won this one. I just need to like get him in focus because I did. I put my hand like this last time I was trying to get a medal in focus and it worked. My dad got this one. And I got this one, which in my opinion is way cooler because it's a skeleton and it has a bit more detail. And even though it says 5K on the middle, we didn't do 5K. It was a 1.6 kilometer race, fun run, you can call it whatever you want. But it sure felt like a 5K. Like it was hard because of all the obstacle courses and how fun it was. I loved it. It was a, it was an amazing experience just to do a event with my family. And I really encourage you guys to do it next year because I'm probably going to do it with my family again because it was so, so much fun and it's just scary and all that. And especially during Halloween, you're like, oh my gosh, it's so fun. Don't forget to smash that like button.